In today's video, It's that time of year already. I really can't believe it, but it's time to pull out some fall decor. And today I want to show you some budget friendly ways that you can make your home feel like fall without spending too much money. So the first thing that I got were these hand towels from Amazon. One of them is actually double sided. So I thought that was kind of neat. You can also find hand towels anywhere. I know my local grocery store has them, Home Goods, Hobby Lobby. I just wanted something that was shipped to my house really quick and was fairly neutral. I don't have a lot of orange colors in my house, so I liked this green one that said pumpkin patch. And then the other one that I put in this bathroom is just a gray one. And this one is the one that's double-sided, which is kind of nice. You can choose what you want. And yes, this is my wonderful bathroom. I really don't know what shade of green this is, but I cannot wait to get my hands on this bathroom and make it over hopefully sometime in the near future. I'm just going to take a minute to clean off the vanity and the mirror while I'm in here redecorating for fall. It's just nice to have a nice clean space when you start decorating. Another budget tip for fall is just to switch out your hand soaps. This is a fun one from Bath & Body Works. I thought my kids would appreciate the color and the design on it. Just so fun for fall. They use this bathroom all the time. And I'm also going to put this orange blossom candle in here. This was pretty cheap from the store at home. I bought it quite a few months ago. And if I don't use my fall scented candles that much, I will just put them away in storage and bring them out next year. The amber color of the glass is very fall-like and the scent is so nice for fall too. So just a little switch in here. And later on in the video, I do end up adding something else. So stay tuned for that. Next, I'm going to change out the picture on my frame TV. I love changing these out for the different seasons. So I'm just gonna pick a fall like one with neutral colors and I really like this one that I just got recently. I get digital downloads from Juniper Print Shop or Collection Prints, even Etsy. You can digital download things and I just put them up on my TV. I'm also going to light this pumpkin pie candle I got from Yankee Candle. I love those. Another idea if you don't have a frame TV is just to switch out some of your art prints that you have. It's really easy to take a picture frame that you already have, take out the picture, and easily get a budget-friendly print from Etsy. I'm laying down at the I picked up this cute little candle from Hobby Lobby, originally $4. Of course, it was half off, so only $2 for this little candle here. I'm going to set it on a wooden tray with the little candle on top. You could also add some leaves or a little wreath around the candle. You could add some acorns or pine cones around there too. Some cute little pumpkins would be adorable. Just something a little little festive to have in your kitchen. I did run to Hobby Lobby to get some fall things for various videos coming up and a budget friendly fall tip is to get a new mug, especially at 50% off at Hobby Lobby. These are a great deal. I did end up picking one and you can keep this out on your counter by your coffee maker and it just adds some fun decor. 
This one was $12, 50% off. It was only $6. I am going to show you my coffee maker that I love. I'm gonna let you hear a little bit of the sound that it makes when it's on. It does grind fresh coffee each time. If you love essential oils like I do, now is a good time to switch out those summer scents for some fall ones. The great thing about essential oils is they last a long time. Some of these I've had for years and years, but orange, cedarwood, nutmeg, and in this one I decided to use cinnamon bark. It smells just like a fall candle in my kitchen. It is so nice. All right, you'll have to ignore the sound. The sprinklers are on outside. So I am in the basement. I have a little section of home decor right here. And I already found a few things that I can use for some fall decor. So definitely shop what you have. But I know up here I have this faux wheatgrass up here so I'm gonna get that down this was from Target I think this was last year $20 I'm sure if you had a vase you could find something like this even on Amazon maybe at Target has some look at these though this is kind of a greenish color and then this is a camel colored one that is perfect for fall I could even put them on this tray that I already have. So really make sure that you go through your home decor stash because you never know what you will find. <gasps> I forgot I had that and I love it. So I think I might get that out and some faux leaves. This candle was also Target and I think mandarin orange blossom that would be a nice fall scent so i think i'm gonna get that out and put that on my brand new kitchen table that i just got so we're gonna take those upstairs this is only part of my home decor i'm gonna show you a little peek but it is a disaster back here my husband is going to build some more shelves for me we also have our extra food storage and right behind me is Oh man, all my Christmas stuff. So we need to get this organized sooner than later. It is completely chaotic back here, but I am going to have rows and rows of shelves for all my decor. All right, you get a little sneak peek of my brand new table. That will be in an upcoming video. But this is all stuff that I had in my basement. So it's really fun to shop what you have. And the great thing about faux flowers is that they last forever. So these I actually had in another video. They're from Amazon. They were a great price. They have so many colors. I will link them in the description below. But these are gorgeous. A beautiful color for fall. Let's see, this one I got from Hobby Lobby last year, but I'm pretty sure they have them every year. $7, they were on sale for $3.50. I always get their flowers when they're on sale. I only have two of these. I don't know why I didn't get more, but we'll have to see if they will work in maybe a vase that has a small top like this. 
And then I do have this wheatgrass that I purchased from Amazon. So cute for fall. We'll see how that works. You could even combine some of these together. We'll see, I might need to get more of these before they actually fit nice in a vase. But let's play around with this stuff and see where we can put it. Wait now. A few tricks that I want to show you. As you can see right here, the stems are way too long. So what I do is I just bend the bottom instead of cutting it. That way, if I ever need to reuse it in a different size vase, it will work. And that is just a little trick to get your flowers to fit without having to cut them. And also another tip in this little vase down here, I stuffed some plastic grocery bags. They just act as a nice filler piece if you don't have a lot of stems or need something to be contained in there nicely. You can just stuff some bags in there and once the leaves are in there, no one is ever going to see them. I will link all the products that I can in the description below. I hope that you are enjoying this video and if you are, please hit that subscribe and that like button and make sure you turn on all notifications. One thing that I like to be mindful of is we are a family of six and I want to be able to see my kids across the table. So I try not to have anything too tall on my dining tables. Otherwise, you won't be able to see the people across from you. So this vase is a good height. And then I just added the little candle. I don't need too much on there. We just eat here and food gets all over. So the less that I have, the less I have to clean around. So this was very budget friendly. I didn't purchase anything this year for my table. I had all of these things, but a great idea would be if you already have a vase, repurpose it. And if you need to buy a few small flowers or leaves or stems, you can do that for fairly cheap. Just make sure Hobby Lobby is having a good sale or check out Amazon too. I did end up putting the wheat with the vase in this bathroom. It looks adorable in the corner. You are just getting all the sneak peeks today, but this is a sneak peek of my front entryway. Although I did just buy another table. This is from Target and I got another one from Target. I'm just not sure that I'm in love with this one. So I did just buy a new one to put here and my art print needs to be put in the frame. But this is where I put these flowers for now. I need to get this area set up so I can style it. This will be in my front entryway video, which is going to be coming out very soon. Another budget friendly tip for fall is to purchase a new blanket. These are from Home Goods, $13. I know Walmart always has fun seasonal blankets as well. Throw this over your couch, put away the other blankets that you have, and it will just be so fun for fall. Pillows are another budget friendly fall decor idea. These ones are from Hobby Lobby, half off. You can find colored ones or plain ones. Another tip I have is just to reuse the pillows you already have, but find a pillowcase off of Amazon or Etsy. I will link a few below and you can just pop those right over your current pillow so you don't have to go buy a new pillow. I am going to use these ones that I had in my basement so I didn't spend any money on these. They are from Target Studio McGee line from last year. Just a nice neutral stripe pillow with some cozy warm colors in there. And then that green blanket I have on the side of my couch, I actually have that out all year long, but it is a nice dark green for fall time. It's a perfect time to bring out some of those darker blankets. I also love the plaid buffalo check blankets. They're some of my favorites for fall. Sweet.
I am also going to switch out the blanket on my green couch over here. I really love this couch. I just released my living room makeover video, so make sure you check that out where I show this whole room and how I made it over. I love these soft, cozy pillows also from Target. I love them. They just create a nice, cozy vibe. Lastly, I am going to put this blanket over these chairs. I love draping blankets over chairs and couches. It just adds a cozy vibe. This pillow has a little bit of green tint to it. I don't know if you can tell on the camera. I'm just gonna put this in the other one. Again, I had that in storage. So great to shop your home. I hope that you enjoyed this video. I have some more fall ones and some new things coming out. I am very excited to share those with you. I hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you back here soon.